case. Um, last time we did get some spirit box action. That's the one that Wagner actually came with for. Hey Felicia, thanks for watching. Just update you, we are at Lakeview Cemetery in Buell, Minnesota. It's supposed to be one of the most haunted cemeteries in Minnesota. This creepy thing. I'm not quite sure. No, we never anything. Just for the walkthrough. Oh, sorry, Jess. You want me to run in there? Yeah, here. I don't go in there because the spider. Oh, oh come on. Oh, flash for you. Talk about the, the circle or the whole thing. So I'm kind of curious too. Yeah. Oh, there's water in it. Let's see this. Tell me what you guys see down here. Here. Lance is on the head in the rafters. There's these on. That is, this is creepy. Well, this whole building is actually super creepy. Definitely, like, do not come here alone, guys. This whole cemetery, to be honest, people are coming and going at all times. And I don't think they're here to do anything related to the cemetery, which makes it worse, to be honest. Yeah. What's up there? There's rain. Oh, yeah. Don't try. I don't fall. The building's like one part. It's beautiful here, though. Oh, this way. Yeah. I haven't seen you in a while, just so you know, we are at the Lakeview Cemetery and Buell, Minnesota. It is said to be the most haunted cemetery in Minnesota. This is my third time here. Looks great. Okay. That's super pretty. Makes sense. That's a human-sized statue. I'm going to show you guys where it disappears. There is a little cemetery off the path. Um, I'm not verified this myself, so please take it for yourselves. But it is said to be where the TV patients from a sanatorium, where they would build their own claim patients, and things like they were did. Um, unfortunately, none of them have names. There may be a few headphones on there, but I don't think there's any. But they only have numbers, and it's super freaking sad. Super sad. What's he doing? Still daylight, so I guess I can go down here by myself. I get um, more courageous with each investigation that I do, but come nightfall, all bets are off. I'm chicken shit, not gonna lie. So we'll see how tonight goes. All right, this is it. I see we have a fourth person. Hello, whoever joined us. It's not showing me. So, someone brought um, ribbons, and I thought that was super sweet because last time I was here, they weren't here, and the cemetery, look, or this part of it, was completely abandoned. Um, but, so, Jesse thinks that these are, um, what did you say these are? Empty ones? Markers, yeah. Heard where to put them. However, if you look, it looks like you can see where the graves are. So I am begging to differ on that one because they do have numbers on it and the grass oh, is no. this colored. But these are what they look like. See, it goes all the way down here. There's a whole row of graves here. That's all covered up. Oh, I didn't even see these ones. There's not one there. But like this stuff is like sinking into the swamp, which is very eerie as well. Jesse actually looked up <laughs> on TV and then bodies to make sure we weren't like exposing ourselves to anything. Um, 